this is just an update video from my last video which you can see on screen here have i been scammed by toys wonderland limited now this is the video that's blown up the most on my channel in such a short amount of time it's had 3.3 k views in two days and you can see there's a lot of comments here a lot of them i've been responding to to try and help people and I wanted to show you what I've done since posting the video. So as you can see here, I've sent Toys Wonderland an email, giving them a link to my video saying to reveal what they have done. I'm still waiting for my item and I'm still demanding you send it or provide a full refund back to my credit card. I also sent them another email saying that I've commented with a link to this video on every post on your Toys Wonderland Twitter slash X page. Some people think I have too much time on my hands. I also messaged them on their Instagram with a link to my video. But now back to their Twitter page. And look, there's the Wonder Woman that I'm waiting on. Let's click on that post. There I am. We'll go back, click on the next post. There I am. We'll go back, click on the next post. There I am. And I did this for every post on their Twitter page or X page. Now here's a troubling thing that I've noticed. Last night, when I was looking at Justin's collection channel videos, I went up to 10 months ago and I was putting a comment to tell people about my experience on my YouTube channel on videos that have reference to Toys Wonderland. So for example, if we go over to Dr. Strange here. And last night the comments went through, but this morning, if I try to post a comment, then it'll show up here. But then if I refresh the page, my comment is nowhere to be seen. And so it appears as though Justin has done something that is withholding my comments. And the question is why Justin? Don't you want something to be done about the issues that we, we've had? with Toys Wonderland. I mean, you've got the disclaimer here on your video. As of September 4th, 2023, I am no longer affiliated with Toys Wonderland in any way. Please ensure you do your own independent research before ordering using trusted sites such as trustpilot.com. Well, isn't research also looking at my video and collaborating with other people who have had uh, bad experiences to understand what's going on? But then now you've blocked or you've censored me on your channel. So please comment on my video and tell me why have you done that? What is going on? What's the problem? And time for the big update, which is I woke up this morning to a WhatsApp message from someone purporting to be Andy from Toys Wonderland. Just wanted to connect with you to assure you that your order will be with you within seven days, which means it might already be on the way in transit. So I messaged them back. Do you have a tracking number? And that was a few hours ago, so no response yet. And it looks like it was a legitimate WhatsApp message because I did get an email from Toys Wonderland from the same person purportedly saying, we are sorry for the delay this has taken. Your order will be with you within this month. I will make sure that it is out for dispatch within this week. So I'm still getting conflicting messages. So just wanted to say thank you to everybody for your support, for your kind words, for your comments. Thank you for bringing awareness to these issues by commenting and sharing your ideas and your stories. I will continue to advocate for everybody. Even if they do send me my goods, I will say to them, you need to help other people here because there's a lot of issues with a lot of customers from your company and you are causing very poor experiences with people and causing a lot of stress too, because there is considerable money involved. So thanks once again. And I will keep you updated.